everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. First of all, I gotta address my top because, oh my goodness, I'm upset. I'm upset with this top. Like, seriously, this is the first time I'm wearing it. These puffy sleeves. Don't even get me started. Don't even get me started right now. But I did want to say for anyone curious, this is fake fur. You will never catch me wearing real fur. So <laughs> it's beautiful though. Like, oh my goodness, I'm obsessed. But anyways, that is not what the video is about. Today we are going to be reviewing the brand Selkie. Not silky, but Selkie with an E. I'm probably pronouncing it wrong. Basically, they make the infamous puff dress. dress. I believe that's what it's called. It basically cuts right under the boob and it goes flowing out. It's so cute. It's pretty short and it was on pre-order. I ordered this like four months ago and it's finally got here. So I'm so excited to see how it looks. The pictures on their Instagram are so beautiful and these dresses are not cheap. So you guys were very curious to hear about them. If they're worth the money, how do they look? Are they as cute as the Instagram pictures? And today we are going to find out. So I have a big Rubbermaid with a bunch of pieces to try from the brand. They're all very similar. Like it's like a puffy fun dress, but I wanted to get a few just to see if it's any different. I don't know, we'll see. Let's dive in right now. Okay, I feel like we need to start with the dress that was the hardest to get my hands on. Here is the bag. It says Selkie across it in like an orangey pink tone. This is the pink dress. And when I think of this dress, I think of this picture. So, so beautiful. I hope it even looks half as good as that picture because I will be very content. I don't know if this style is going to suit me, but you guys can be the judge. Let us see this beautiful dress. This is just going to look like a giant piece of light pink fabric for you guys. But basically in the front, it's straight across. And then we have these really, really floppy, puffy sleeves. And it goes into a pretty long skirt that honestly reminds me of a marshmallow. Like it's gonna be so fluffy. There's so many layers of fabric under here that will just make it so, I don't even know, what is it called? Like, what is that? cut called like it's not an a-line what is it okay i don't know what it's called but you'll know exactly what i mean when you see it on it like cuts here and just flows out like a little cupcake dress maybe it's a cupcake dress i don't know but it feels great like the fabric is so nice and smooth and this has been crinkled up in a bag and pulling it out it like is hardly wrinkly or anything so Let's put this on so it doesn't look like a giant piece of fabric. You can see some shape to it and we will see if it's worth the price tag. Let's put it on. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I decided to keep my bra on under here just because this fabric right here, if I didn't have my bra on, it would definitely be see-through. So I'm not gonna do that. If you had this dress, I mean, it's up to you, but just one thing to note, this piece is definitely a little bit see-through just between me and you. So I'm gonna keep that on just to keep it PG in here. But oh my gosh, this is so cute. Like I have to spin. It looks just like the picture. This is adorable. I think the picture they were like sitting like. I love the puffy sleeves. I love puffy sleeves. The hems are like a little itchy though, which I'm a little bit surprised by just because the fabric is so nice and soft. I do feel pretty itchy in the back. Yeah, I don't know why that is, but it's really itchy. But honestly, it's so cute that I could forget about the itching, but I think it is worth mentioning. Around the seams where it's sewn, it's a little bit itchy, especially on the back. But like this looks just like the picture. I love the full fluffy skirt and the skirt part isn't see-through which is nice too you know what i've realized i love any skirt that has this roughly bit at the bottom i didn't know that i liked that but now i'm seeing like a theme i love it when there's that feature i just do but yes i feel like this dress was definitely worth the wait i wish it wasn't so itchy but i do in fact love it still okay so all the dress styles are basically the same the only differences are the length so like that pink one was a longer style this is a lot shorter some people i feel like would consider this to be so short it might just be a top but it is in fact sold as a dress. It's a very cute, like cupcake style dress. Same sort of idea here, but way different print. Obviously this is a cheetah print, a lot darker, and the sleeves are puffy, 
but longer. So a little different, but pretty similar here. It gives off like a very different vibe. And I will say it is super short looking at it. Like I'm trying to see, will this be long enough for me? It might like just cover my bum. So we will see how this looks. Let's put it on. I'll probably look like eight feet tall, but we'll see. Maybe we'll like it. Oh my. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I like forgot how short these are. I'd be a little bit concerned that I would, am I gonna flash everyone? Yes, I definitely am. Okay, good to know. It's so cute. Definitely this one's a lot shorter than the other one, which I knew there were like different sizes. And this is the short one. And I think that it's so adorable. It honestly feels like a really intense peplum top. I really love the different vibe of this one too, because it's like the dark with the cheetah print. It definitely brings a different vibe than the light pink and the flowy and the longer. This is adorable. Although, weirdly enough, this one's also itchy. So I'm thinking if you were gonna buy one of these, I would suggest probably getting a slip for under here. Otherwise, I think you might be like scratching all night. So that's one thing just to note. Again, I love the puffy sleeves. I think this is absolutely adorable. I feel like sort of like a giant baby in a good way. I think if I was going to wear heels, my legs would look a mile long and that's also a positive. I think it's very cute. I think I would definitely, yeah, I'm gonna flash everyone. Okay, good to know. I don't think everyone's gonna absolutely love this style, but if you love it, I would suggest this because it's very, very cute. And I, I have honestly not seen any other dresses with this style. So, I mean, that's why they're called the puff dress because they're puffy. Okay, this feels kind of funny now that I bought this huge red faux fur dress jacket. It's like supposed to fit perfectly over these puff dresses if you're wearing it out in the cold. This is a jacket for on top. Honestly, this gave me like Narnia vibes. I'm not really sure why, but I was kind of obsessed with it. Never did I think I would own a big fluffy red jacket, but it caught my attention. I was obsessed. Feels really weird to have this now. Keep in mind, I ordered this in January and it is now April. So summer is quickly approaching and I just bought a big faux fur jacket. Yeah, but oh my goodness, this is a heavy jacket and it's so, so soft. Oh my goodness, look at it. It's like Christmas colors. Look at me, green and red. Yeah, it has a lot of heft to it. So soft on the outside. And then the inside is like this beautiful silky fabric. Oh, silky from Selkie. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, let's put this on. I feel like everything is just a giant piece of fabric. You're not gonna understand the shape until I put it on. Okay, I'm just gonna throw this jacket over top because it's supposed to fit perfectly over here. Oh, it is such a heavy jacket, like in a good way. It would actually keep you warm, I think. This is so cute, oh my goodness. This is adorable. This is like the most, okay, I need to think of different words other than cute. This is honestly becoming problematic. I just can't stop. Like all this stuff is adorable. Okay, I wasn't sure if there was gonna be pockets, but there is. This is so, oh my gosh. This is so soft. I feel like a giant teddy bear. Honestly, if someone was going to hug me, I feel like a teddy bear. And my dress is like disappeared under here. I feel like Santa Claus. Look at me right now. I'm Santa's kid, what up? I really like the cut of this jacket. It follows the same theme as the puff dress where it's like tighter and then it flares out. I think that is such a good idea for them to create a jacket that fits over the dresses and the puffy sleeve that tightens up. Oh yeah, I will definitely be wearing this in the winter. This is adorable. I've actually never had a like jacket that goes over dresses. So this is really cute. I like it. Makes me feel like I'm in a winter wonderland, but it's literally getting nice out right now. <laughs> okay, this dress is something maybe a little bit different. It isn't like a chiffon fabric. It actually feels sort of like a tablecloth in a good way, like a soft, soft tablecloth. This gives me like 60s vibes fabric. Let me shake it out a little. Oh. Okay, here's what this looks like. This fabric definitely got a lot more wrinkly, but as you can see, it's still a puff dress, but it's a lot less puffy, if that makes sense. Like it falls a lot straighter. It's got all these little pleats in here. Same sort of style. I think it's gonna be pretty short, but it's very, very cute. And I love, I love, I love 
love a puffy sleeve. Don't even get me started. Let's put this on. Okay, this may be kind of surprising, but this one has been my favorite thus far. I feel like it's the least of the puffy puff dress, but I really like it. It's definitely wrinkly. I would need to iron it, but it's not itchy at all. I definitely think what's making the other ones itchy is just the fabric because this one's way different and then I don't have that issue. I love that this feels like an old curtain in the sense of like, I swear my grandma would have this fabric hanging in her house and I love that to be honest. I feel like the skirt is a tad bit longer than the short puffy dresses and then when I spin, it it kind of stays in place a little bit more. I like this a lot. I don't know why. I kind of wasn't expecting for this to be my favorite. I mean, it's cute enough, but I don't know. How could you beat the puff dress, you know? I love the pleated skirt. I love the print and the pattern, and it's just so, so comfortable. I don't know, you guys. Now I'm like all kind of confused. This is my fave. Who am I kidding? I just like whatever's comfiest, and this one's the comfiest. Okay, last but certainly not least, the exact same style as the cheetah print one, a short puff dress. I just couldn't say no to this rainbow tulle. I saw this and I was like, oh my goodness, why? Why am I doing this? But like, look at it. How beautiful is this dress? I just love all of the colors and it's not like a pastel. It's almost like this like toned down muted rainbow tulle. I have no idea where I would wear these. Seriously, not a clue. I'm gonna have to like go out and have a picnic just so I can take a picture in these and then I'll probably donate them. Maybe I'll keep one, but yeah, this is so cute. I feel like I've said cute like a thousand times, but what did you expect? Okay, let's put them on. Okay, here is this rainbow style dress on. You guys, I'm starting to feel kind of funny. I swear to you, I had a dress just like this when I was a baby. Like in a good way, I'm not trying, like that, I mean that in the best way possible, but like I see some resemblance. I do, I really do. Especially when I turn around, I would be so nervous in these short ones to flash people. I just think it would be inevitable. Like the way I run around and flop around, like, yeah. I would have to wear some shorts under here. But I mean, just like the others, the style is very, very cute. I definitely think this needs like a picnic photo shoot where you have like one of those mini cakes and everything. I think that would look great. I love the way it looks. I love the style. I love the fabric. The only critique I have is this one's very itchy around the hems, especially this one in the back. So if I could change one thing, it would probably be that. But I mean, it's very cute and it looks just like the picture. All right, you guys, what did you think of these selkie dresses? I thought the styles, <laughs> what did you think? I thought, <laughs> comment down below what you think. I'll give you a second. Okay, now back to what I thought. I thought the styles were adorable. I love a puffy dress. I love a puffy sleeve. I love a style that isn't cinching my waist. I will say some of the hems are quite itchy. That's my only con, honestly. I think they are adorable. I understand the hype and they are as cute as they are in the Instagram pictures in real life. Make sure to comment down below which dress was your absolute favorite because I will be reading through the comments and I am curious to know. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!